In this video, I'm going to show you a nice trick to create a horizontal line on a tall vase coming up. Welcome to I Love Ikebana. I'm Akemi Sagawa, Sogit School Ikebana instructor. On this channel, I share with you Ikebana tutorials and practical tips for your arrangement. We will use crossbars to fix branches. Use a strong and flexible branch. Cut it slightly longer than the inside diameter of the vase. One end of the stick should be cut at an angle. The other end should be cut straight. Make another stick of equal length the same way. Place one stick about an inch lower than the rim of the vase with its slant cut end facing up. Pull up the slant cut end until the stick is horizontal. With the slant cut end facing down, place the second stick on top of and perpendicular to the first stick. Push down the slant cut end to make it horizontal. Now with the two sticks, you have divided the opening of the vase in four sections. Make sure that the crossbars are placed firm enough against the inner wall of the vase. Once the crossbars are placed securely, fill the container with water. Cut the end of shin, the longest main stem, at an angle. Place shin leaning on one section created by the crossbars. With exact angle, the end of the branch should touch the inside wall of the vase firmly. Cut the end of soe, the second longest main stem, and place it the same way. Both shin and soe are placed leaning on crossbars creating a dramatic horizontal line. Now place hikai, the shortest main stem. Make sure the flower is facing the front, not up. Place the stem with the bent tip touching against the back wall of the vase. When adding more flowers and supporting branches, it'll be better not to use all the four sections divided by the crossbars. Rather, try to use only two sections. Place stems on top of each other in the same section. This way, the arrangement becomes more stable and looks neat around the rim of the vase. Looking at the total balance, cut off excess leaves and branches. Since this crossbar method creates tension on the vase, thin, delicate, and valuable vases may not be suitable. If you have any question or would like to know more about Sogetsu Ikebana, please write in the comment area down below. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. See you next time.